hello children welcome to aims india's online classes this is biology session reaching the age of adolescence part 1 in the previous chapter you have learnt how animals reproduce it is uh, only after growing up to a certain age that the human beings and many other animals can reproduce isn't it why can humans reproduce only after certain age so answer for this in this chapter reaching the age of adolescence you will learn about the changes that takes place in the human body after which a person becomes capable of reproduction okay so the let us uh, begin the story the lesson with a story navin is studying eighth class he is so active he remains idle for uh, over 6 months he even feels shy while talking to strangers and even with the relatives visiting their home if he starts speaking his voice becomes uh, somewhat harsh he does not care to follow suggestions and advices of his parents he shows restlessness if the parents tell him to pack the baggage or bring goods from the shop his parents are worried on noticing his changes or the changing behavior Naveen's grandmother says he is growing now that is why he is not listening to their words isn't it children i think uh, you might have experienced this some of you also may behave like this why have you noticed that you are growing children it is a um, very interesting your friends which you, whom you met before holidays in after holidays some of them were looking uh, very funny with a hairy line above their lips isn't it the growth begins from the day one is born okay immediately after the birth the growth begins but upon crossing the age of 10 or 11 years there is a sudden spurt in growth which becomes noticeable the changes taking place in the body are part of growing up they indicate that you are no longer a child but are on the way to become or becoming an adult okay it is a strange period when you are neither a child nor an adult isn't it growing up is a natural process the period of life when the body undergoes changes leading to reproductive maturity it is called the adolescence it is called adolescence okay adolescence begin around the age of 11 years and lasts up to 18 to 19 years of age since this period covers uh, the teens T E E N. Okay, see here. Infant, childhood, boyhood, okay, adulthood, and developed a man. Okay, the teens means thirteen to eighteen years or nineteen years of age. They are called teens, adolescents. Adolescents are also called teenagers. 
in girls adolescence may begin a year or two earlier than in boys also the period of adolescence varies from person to person the human body undergoes several changes during adolescence these changes mark the onset of puberty okay the most important change which marks the puberty is that the boys and girls become capable of reproduction the puberty ends when an adolescent reaches reproductive maturity okay so you need to know the changes which takes place sudden increase in the height and hairy line above the lips in the boys these are all the signs of uh, adolescence they wanted to know more about the other changes so let us uh, proceed are you ready children reaching the age of adolescence usually we see the changes in the age of uh, 13 to 19 years this period is called as an adolescence during this period the changes are observed inside means internal and outside external the body means uh, the physical and physiological changes takes place physical means external and the physiological internal the organs and their functioning may change for example changes in the voice growing tall do you observe these changes in you too hope so so write down the changes usually you observe during your adolescence okay so you observe these uh, pictures here wearing the the mobile phone okay spending much time in front of mirror combing hair many times with different styles okay so this is the age 13 to 19 years means the 8th class 7th class onwards okay so this age is called adolescence age okay many changes you observe both internal and external try to notice those changes how you reached the age of adolescence is mustache growing on your lips okay you put yes or no beside okay like this some questions are asked you try to respond yes no okay next did your voice change once again yes your voice change during this period it may become harsh or hairs growing under the armpit okay check yourself are you taking care of your face by applying powder and combining um, or uh, combing your hairs frequently this is uh, the change observed during the period of adolescence next are you feeling shy when talking with the uh, opposite gender okay if you are a boy talking with a girl you feel shy or if you are a girl talking with a boy feel shy say yes or no okay you check yourself this is a checklist of questions are you interested to play with the uh, opposite gender which uh, you have done earlier when you are a small kid you don't know shy you will play naturally but after reaching this age say a little 
change observed in the behavior are you showing restlessness while uh, your parents suggest uh, to do something are you getting irritation okay next if your answers are yes for these questions above questions for most of the above questions it reflects that you are in adolescence phase okay if your answer is yes definitely you are in the adolescence phase it is an important phase in the life of individual where lot of changes appear okay during adolescence changes occur in external internal parts of the body you will show interest to spend time with the peers what is the meaning of peer peer means uh, your friends same age group people okay you will show interest to spend time with the peer group the changes may be misleading that could be one of the reason for worry of your parents okay the changes uh, may be misleading because you will give more value to the words of your friends at this age than the words of your elders or your teachers or your parents okay so this misleading may be worrying the your parents so adolescents uh, does not show interest to discuss about the changes with their parents okay this is uh, the complex stage of life because they grow from childhood to adulthood or adolescence okay this is the most uh, complex stage of uh, life okay children so you can see here you are in the middle okay one side hey you are a kid go and play there only some people will say next other side no no you are too big we don't play with you this is another side okay who am i the question arises so it is a a stage of a, a dilemma means unable to take the decision you are too old to play one one side you are not old enough to sit with us go and play so this is another side okay so this is the state of uh, adolescent mind the changes at adolescence they have a lot of stress due to these changes and or uh, unable to decide whether they belong to adulthood or childhood okay so they are in a confusion state this is the period of confusion and transition state okay unable to take the decision the increase in the height growth is one of the important characteristic in human beings can we go on growing throughout life throughout lifetime we can't grow like uh, plants because we are animals human beings we grow to certain height for a certain period only this change takes place in adolescent at maximum pace okay see this is the the third stage you can see the childhood from childhood you can see in this figure very fast uh, growth we can observe here this stage okay 
you can see child boy adulthood this is the childhood adulthood okay so in uh, girls compared to boys the adolescent age begins uh, one or two years before only okay at the age of 11 okay in boys it may be at the age of 13 but in the girls the adolescent stage reach earlier compared to boys the changes at adolescent you may have observed that you and your friends are growing and slowly losing the child like features okay childish features you are losing an individual reaches his or high her maximum height during the adolescent period only you may also be growing taller now do you know up to which age you will grow do you know children up to which age you you will uh, grow yes up to the age of uh, 18 years you may grow can you guess uh, how much height uh, you will get okay you can uh, guess your height uh, uh, by comparing with the chart the age group what is the weight what is the what do you call that chart uh, pediasure chart pedigree chart okay where you can uh, easily identify uh, when you visit uh, a uh, doctor there you will find some charts okay what is the nutrition required what is your age what is the normal range of uh, height weight you can compare okay so for this uh, to know the growth rate uh, there is one activity simple activity observing growth rate so here one chart is given the following chart gives the average rate of growth in a height for both boys and girls with the uh, age group here you can see the age of 8 years the percentage of maximum height in boys 72 percent whereas girls 77 percent the age of 9 years 75 percent in boys 81 percent in girls At the age of 10 years the growth will be more rapid 78 percent in the boys 84 percent in the girls at the age of 11 81 88 12 years 84 91 13 years 88 95 14 92 98 15 95 99 16 99 99.5 17 99 100 18 100 100 means up to the age of 18 you will find uh, the growth okay you can see in the graph also the boys and girls the red uh, representing the uh, girls and the yellow graph okay, yellow line representing the boys okay simultaneously so here uh, boys representing the orange line or red line and the blue line representing the girls see it is somewhat more compared to boys okay we were uh, on y axis percentage of uh, full height and uh, on x axis age in years up to 18 years of age if you compare the height will be increasing more in the girls compared to boys but almost uh, 
by 18 years they reach uh, the same point ok 100 percent height. The figure in the column 2 and 3 give the percentage of uh, the height of a person has reached at the age as given in the column 1 ok here column 1 age is given and in column 2 and 3 you will see the height in boys and uh, girls. So, these figures are only representative and uh, there may be individual variations ok because we cannot say exactly ok depends on the internal changes hormonal activity. So, using the data of the table 1 the graph has been drawn here. So, observing the growth uh, let us uh, observe the graph and answer the following question. Here some questions are given. So, you see the graph when does the growth in height uh, nearly stop ok at the age of uh, 18. Which period of age according to you is the fastest growing uh, period? The fastest growing period is between the 13 to 18 13 to 18 here you can see the fast growth for boys whereas for girls which period of age is fastest growing period for girls the fastest growing period for girls it is uh, between uh, uh, you can uh, see 11 years ok 2 years before 11 to 15 you can see 11 to 15 C. So, this is the fastest period of growth in the girls, whereas in the boys 13 to 18 ok. Next, who do grow faster? How can you say ok? So, by seeing the graph uh, the girls grow faster compared to boys. Initially the girls grow faster than boys. Later by the age of 18 both reach 100 percent. So, initially the girls grow faster than boys, but uh, by about 18 years of age uh, both reach their maximum height. The rate of growth in height varies in different individuals. Some may grow suddenly and then growth slows down gradually. So, there is one formula to calculate the calculating the height present height in centimeter we have to consider present height in centimeter divided by maximum height that uh, you may gain into 100 that gives uh, the percentage of full height at this age as given in the chart. Previously the chart is given no? in that chart. So, for example, uh, Sneha is 13 years of age, 13 years old, her height is 125 centimeters our height is 125 centimeters ok height in centimeters we are considering. So, at the end of uh, the growth period she is likely to be 
so what we have to do maximum height that you may gain that she may gain is 95 centimeters more into 100 okay so sneha's height we are calculating so this gives uh, 131 centimeter 131.5 centimeters so like this you can calculate your height the present height in centimeter by maximum height that you you may gain into 100 percent so that uh, into 100 is equal to the percentage of the full height at this age okay so this is the calculation you can do use the information given in the table and calculate the maximum height that you will reach table one shows that the girls grow faster than boys in their adolescence period why it is an example okay you can uh, if you calculate uh, so boys 72 percent at the age of eight uh, girls 77 percent and 9 age 75 percent and 81 percent in the girls so like that if you calculate uh, so at the age of uh, 11 the boys uh, increase 81 percent height whereas uh, girls 88 percent the age of 12 84 percent of increase in the height and 91 percent in the girls 13 years of age 88 percent in the boys and 95 percent in the girls and at the age of 14 92 percent in the boys and 98 percent in the girls so 15 years 95 percent in the boys and 99 percent in the girls finally at the age of 18 they reach the 100 percent growth 100 percent height okay so the table one shows that the girls grow faster than the boys in their adolescent period so an example by the age of uh, 11 a boy has reached 81 percent of his uh, probable height while a girl has reached 88 percent of her full height so you can uh, calculate this height by forming the group okay with the help of your teacher divide yourself form a group with uh, six students in your class measure your height and calculate your uh, future heights in the following table so this activity helps you to calculate how tall you would be and to reach uh, a proper height uh, there are several factors involved so one of them is uh, proper nutrition nourishment okay you can calculate uh, with the help of your group you can calculate name of the student and age present height how much the maximum growth in height in future by using uh, which formula by using uh, the formula present height in centimeter by maximum height that uh, the person may gain into 100 gives the maximum growth okay you can do this and uh, tell the height future height of that uh, particular person particular friend okay okay children i hope you understood please read the textbook thank you for watching our video please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for receiving latest updates